Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have another Ipsy bag opening. So this is just the bonus video of the week. It's gonna be a really short, short video. I'm just gonna open this and yeah. If you're new to this channel, I just open them and I get excited over everything. <laughs> Spoiler alert, but yeah, let's open it now. I'm so excited. This is the June bag and Supposedly it's another good one. So the theme for June's bag is swim into beauty and we have Crispy right here and oh my god I was missing out on her videos. She is incredible and I love her personality as well so I'm happy I got Crispy right here. <laughs> And then we have the same thing, like slap a picture of your goodies, blah blah blah. But she is rocking the red eyeshadow. I don't know if you can see that. I like this. So this is the June bag, and honestly, I'm a little underwhelmed. It just seems very, very plain, even for my taste. And I'm like plain Jane when it comes to clothing, but just seems very eh, kind of underwhelming, especially compared to last month's bag, which was my favorite bag. So we just have Ipsy written all over on the back is I guess supposed to be kind of like a scuba material but it isn't just feels like I don't know like foam. This is the only exciting thing like a coral zipper but eh, I'm pretty underwhelmed by this bag. At least it's kind of big that's the only plus but eh, it seems kind of like a whatever bag. The first thing is this nail polish by by who? A nail polish by Absolute New York Nail Lacquer with hardener and it looks like this so it's a nice teal color and this shade is turquoise. <laughs> there you go, very simple name. I like it. I like these colors. I never heard of Absolute New York but hey I'll try it. The next thing I see in this bag is another product by Dr. Brandt and I think I received this is probably my third Dr. Brand product in a Nipsey bag, and this one is the Pores No More Vacuum Cleaner Blackhead Extractor Mask. So I've never received a mask. I've gotten two other like primary primers, but this is the first mask. It seems like a decent product. I can see it's only filled like halfway, but we'll see how this one turns out. I have high hopes. I have black kids on my nose, so hopefully it works. The next product in this bag is this leave-in conditioner by Pure Brazilian. And yeah, so it's just a little spray bottle. Seems like a little thick for a, like <laughs> for a spray bottle product. It says Pure Brazilian Miracle Leave-In Conditioner with Keratin for gorgeous, silky, smooth hair, color save UV protection. Let's see. My hair is like super dirty, but doesn't have a very strong scent, which is good. Seems like a cool product to have in like your gym bag or something. I'm gonna start swimming soon. I, I used to swim a long time ago, but I'm gonna start swimming again just to like switch things up when I work out. So maybe I'll just keep this in my bag so after I'm done swimming, I can just spray some conditioner and that will be it. We have two more things in the bag. One of them is the Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer. I already have a full size full size version. I had I got another one at Generation Beauty and now I have another one. Uh, I'm just gonna give this to my mom. I don't need another one. I like this primer. I'm not in love with it, but I can understand why people like it a lot just because it does kind of diminish the appearance of pores and everything, but it's just not my favorite primer. I don't know. And the very last product is this by a brand called Tristique. <laughs> And it is a mini shadow crayon in Aspen Pine. So it looks like it's missing a cap, but it's just the design. So you just pop it open and you have a nice shadow pencil. And this one is kind of like a olive green color. It's not very like summery, but I dig this color. Once again, I've never heard of uh, Tristique, so I don't know what to expect. I don't know if it's a drugstore, if it's like a higher end brand, if it's like natural, whatever. I just don't know. <laughs> but the packaging's cool. It just made me think like, oh my god, is it missing a cap? But it's just they're trying to fool you. So that was it for June's Ipsy bag. Honestly, I wasn't completely blown away. I think this was one of the most underwhelming bags I received, but I'm excited for I'm excited for this just because it's gonna be useful <laughs> when I start swimming. Um, another thing I'm excited for this, the mask. Hopefully it works on my blackheads. 
and this I'm just kind of like uh, again I really wanted to get the Too Faced liquid lipstick and I didn't get it oh why <laughs> I didn't need one of these so that sucked um, I wish I had more information about this I don't know if it's waterproof long wearing it just says uh, Tristique and then the mini eyeshadow pencil thing so I don't know about anything about this brand and the same thing with this I just don't know if it's a uh, high-end if it's drugstore where you can find it I like the color though if you also get a Nipsey bag let me know what you got in your bag in the comments below I would love to know if you got the Too Faced liquid lipstick because I will be a little bit jealous but mostly very happy for you <laughs> I want to know. I never tried them, so you got you guys gotta let me know if they're good or not. But yeah, let me know in the comments below what you got in your bag. Let me know if you tried any of the products that I've received. And I will see you guys very soon in my next video. Hope you guys enjoyed this little bonus video of the week. And if you're not subscribed, make sure to subscribe to my channel. I make two videos every single week, sometimes three, maybe four. <laughs> depending on if I have time and on my mood of course but yeah click right here to subscribe I will see you guys very soon in my next video and yeah I'll talk to you guys soon bye